I'm here today with USN to talk about the power of trust with Zoe Wright. Zoe is someone who's overcome a painful and chronic condition to become an international bodybuilding champion. Let's go and meet her. Zoe, I know you've got a great story. Tell me about it. If I'm being honest, I struggled in school. So I turned my time into more physical um, activities. So I would join in, I'd be the top of like the 100 meter sprint, the long distance running, the footballer. Mm -hmm. You know, I was known as the active person within the year. And then I had my teenage years of being an absolute nightmare for everyone around me. Bit didn't of a do, rebel. Yep, didn't <laughs> do very well in my GCSEs. And I just like, I just stopped doing sport altogether. So when did it all change for you? When did it all turn around? It changed when my friend actually said, come to football, start playing football again. Um, and I went back to football. I fell in love with sport again. And it was at that point that I started getting um, the first symptoms. Um, of my condition. So I was around 18 when I started getting really bad abdominal cramps and I just couldn't quite figure out what it was. And then six weeks after seeing the doctor, I was just labeled with this chronic illness. When I found out my medication stopped working, I soon realized that to live my life the way I wanted to live it, I had to do, I had to do something. So I, I had to face my biggest fear. I decided to have my large intestine removed. You decided? Yeah, I decided. And the relief that I felt after that surgery from the years of pain, the, the struggle, the embarrassment that comes with living with inflammatory bowel disease, it was almost lifted off my shoulders. Yeah. And just after my surgery, whilst I was lying in a hospital bed, mm. um, dosed up to my eyeballs and morphine, <laughs> I just turned to my partner and said, I'm going to go on stage. I'm going to do a bodybuilding show. Join us next time for part two, where we find out more about Zoe's incredible story and why she believes in the power of trust.